Hello everyone, it's Muhammad again, and in this video I'm showing my recent tool I made for Unity 3D. And this tool is pretty simple, but it's very useful as well. So my tool called my tool called here Debug Proom. So basically, this Debug Proom works on cleaning your code from debug statements like debug.log, debug. Uh, warning, debug.error, debug exception, or whatever. And it works with Poo or C Sharp or JavaScript files. So basically, I found lots of people reporting that Unity sometimes gives strange crashes without any reporting for this crash. And they refer this reason for the huge amount of debug messages. And to remove these debug messages, you have either ways. You can open your ID and keep searching and committing your files, or you should start from the beginning of your project using uh, something like uh, a, a debugging tool you already made or something like this. But here I made a handy solution which helped me to detect this error and I was very lucky because when I disabled all the debug, my crash disappeared. So I decided to put this tool out there in the asset store. So basically here it's very simple, it tells you that anything you are going to do here in this tool, it will, you will not be able to undo this later. And it does make sense as we do everything outside Unity. So basically when you open that tool here, let's check first here. If you check this pull scripts, you have debug.log, debug log warning and log error and yeah and C sharp have the same things and the Java have same things. So if open the tool here and say I need to work with only C sharp files you can select Java, C sharp boo or work with all files at once. And I want to work with log uh, let's work with warning only. And then I have one of three choices. I can say enable or disable or remove. It's already enabled, so let's check disable. It takes a while, and then yeah, it's finished. So let's check our C# -sharp files for warning. So C# -sharp files, as you can see, this warning have been committed here and here and here. So we can come here again, and okay, let's say C# -sharp and warning, and let's enable it. And then if you have a look here all my 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 log warning have been enabled and yeah it, it, it's very easy to use it's very handy and yeah you can say okay let's c sharp and let's all and remove i don't need anymore as you can see it's have been removed now and yeah let's check for boo for example or you can work with all for example you can select all and let's disable an all and if you check boo all the pull files have been disabled, C Sharp already have no debug messages and Java have been disabled and we can enable all again. So we can select all and all and enable and everything will be enabled. So it's very easy to use, very handy and it will help you. Um, yeah, the crash I got, it was in web player, my web player, crash, no report nothing at all and it, I tried to use something like uh, an empty project and put lots of debug messages especially an update or fixed update and your project would probably crash so yeah this should be helping you and I hope it help you clean your project thank you bye bye